All right, here we are at 12561 Langstaff Drive here in Windermere, Florida. It's a very quiet little area here. 2004 build. This is an REO property, so it is owned by a real estate company. So it's not a problem. If it's something you guys like, we just have to submit our offer online and see how it goes. This is a two bed, two bath, two and a half bath. Uh, it's got 1,369 square feet. Uh, it does have a garage uh, in the back. So nice mature landscaping. The HOA is 168 a month. Community pool, maintenance exterior, maintenance ground. Recreational pool, sidewalk indeed. So here is your front entryway. You got a nice coat closet here to the left. There's your upstairs. Head down into the hallway, then into the kitchen that way. So you do have crown molding up top. Nice little detail here along the bottom. There's kind of a, it's a hall closet, but you also have your water heater here in the front. So here we're gonna walk around. This goes into your kitchen. Electrical box, granite countertops, a little bit more updated uh, appliances here, but still fridge air. No um, refrigerator here. Nice little pantry. Again, nice, again, same kind of cabinets of that celebration. Nice cherry oak, it does vent to the outside, which is great. Uh, here is the living space. So we got a little doggy door there. Nice big window, a lot of natural light. And again, back there's the front door. I'm gonna flip right here. Here is the half, no, excuse me, here is the closet, extra storage, right under the stairs. I believe the half bath is right here to our left. There we go. Nice little half bath. Pretty standard pedestal sink. Before we go upstairs. So you have a little back patio area between the house and the garage. Nice white fence. We'll go back here into the garage. Looks like they just updated it or painted the inside. It's very clean. Uh, for some reason, the garage isn't on the, on the electric, so I'm just gonna open it and show you. So here's kind of your back view. So you could have two cars parked right here and two in the garage if you want, which is nice because you also have parking out front, but you have the parking out back. There's your mailboxes right there to the left. So like we talked about, this is a two, two and a half bath. So you've got your half bath downstairs for guests. If you have people over, hanging out downstairs. And each bedroom upstairs has its own bath, which is kind of nice. So just thinking about for future rental, thing like that, things like that. People will like to see that. Here is your HVAC closet. That has a 2021 AC, so that's brand new, which is great. Here is bedroom number one, which I would consider the master. Vaulted ceilings with crown molding. Carpet looks pretty good. Nice little walk-in closet. And then here is your master. Granite countertops, which is really nice. There it is, toilet. Again, it follows the vaulted ceilings in the bedroom, so it makes everything feel bigger, which is great. That's the one nice thing about being on the second floor for your bedrooms. And here's bedroom number two. Get a nice walk-in closet. Crown molding all the way up here. 
And then you've got the full bathroom as well, linen closet. What's up guys? In the same exact shower. I don't know how hot it is in Detroit, but it's hot down here today. I mean, you're pretty standard. Medicine cabinet, things like that. Sorry for the casual look. I was all the way out in Haines City and then ran up here helping a client move. So again, nice double pane window. Oh, excuse me, not. Those are not double pane, but nice windows looking out into a nice quiet street. Rooms are both pretty much the exact same. Right here is your laundry. You got all these appliances stay with the house as well. And you've got another linen closet back here, which is super good. Again, the master, the reason I'm calling it the master is because you've got two sinks up here, right? The other one only has one. So you've got the dual vanities here and a much larger mirror as well. Kill these lights. So you are very close to Disney. If you look at the, on the map as the crow flies, you're kind of on the back side of it. Like I was saying, Disney University's right over here. A lot of the inner workings of Disney's on the back, this back side. So your traffic and things like that are gonna be pretty minimal to get to where you need to go. Yeah, there, one more pass through. And again, two beds, two and a half baths, 1,369 square feet. And you do get a garage.